Hi everyone, my name is Eyal. Welcome to Cato's SE Interviews video series. And today we have with us Sylvain, our sales engineer in France and the Southern Europe. Hi Sylvain. Hi, hi Eyal, how are you? I'm great, thank you. Thank you for being with us. Um, let's start with a short introduction. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Okay, so, so uh, as you said, uh, I'm Sylvain Charer, I'm 36 years old. So yes, I'm the, the current uh, pre-sales engineer for, uh, for Southern Europe. Uh, so it's including mainly France, Italy, Spain, and Portugal. Uh, I work into the um, IT industry since 2005, so 15 years now. Uh, and previously uh, I was a, a senior networking and security at, at Citrix. And before that I was a telecom manager for a French service provider. So. Um, I was uh, able, I will say, in the, since the beginning of my career to see the, the transition from traditional infrastructure to the cloud. And the, the project I belong to uh, will allow clients to complete the entire journey to the cloud uh, by including the last piece uh, of their infrastructure, the, the one and, and the branch office. Okay, cool. So um, how did you join Cato? Uh, it's, it's a funny story, uh, to be transparent. I tried to join in 2018 uh, by joining directly the Kaito uh, HR, uh, but at this stage, uh, uh, Kaito was not ready to open uh, the, the France territory and the Southern uh, Europe. Um, I tried to join in, in, in 2018 uh, because I, I saw a, a vision that no other competitor on the, and vendor on the market has moving uh, one uh, infrastructure uh, by removing um, uh, compute and branch was definitely a, a disruptive approach, and I like the, 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 the concept. So I heard in 2019 uh, that Kaito will uh, maybe uh, open a new position. Uh, so I, I, I uh, reached the uh, HR again, and we, we start to work together in a few days. So it, it's, a, it's a good story, uh, I think, for, for, for both. Wow, yeah, it's, it's great, and I'm very happy that you are this persistent on, uh, on joining us. Um, so you can please briefly describe what is your role is at Cato. What is it that uh, you do on a day-to-day -day basis? Yes. So, so when you are working for a startup, uh, I think you know you don't know what uh, exactly is your role. You have a lot of stuff to manage, but but all all of uh, the tasks are, are really exciting. So we have to do in parallel uh, the promotion of the solution to 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 customer and and, and partner. And in parallel also to building a, a strong channel in order to amplify the, the Kaito uh, uh, journey and the Kaito vision to the, to, to, the, to the Southern Europe. So I will say in general, I, I'm focused on five areas. So the developing new and existing accounts, uh, provide pre-sales uh, technical expertise and product demonstration, working on RFP and RFI uh, in order to provide a response to, to customer. And I will say more in the internal, working with transversal team like marketing, like sell channel, in order to expand our, our footprint uh, on the market. And the last task, uh, I think it's to provide tra training updates, webinars, seminar, and workshop to to uh, to maintain the, the knowledge uh, for our partner and, and our prospect. So uh, yeah, basically it's a lot of things, but it's really uh, exciting to be part of this. Great. Uh, That's great. Yeah. So let's uh, move ahead to your, uh, most favorite demo? So yeah, I'm the, I'm the network and security engineer for a, a company with a, a 60, uh, 60 branch all around the world, China, US, uh, EMEA, a uh, lot of sites uh, all over the world. And uh, I just received today uh, a new email uh, from a guy who, will, uh, who is AL, it's the, the CTO of the, the <laughs> company where I work. And uh, let, let's let's read. So, okay. Hi, Sylvain. As discussed last week, we will fully deploy two new applications this week that move from pilot to production for our 3,000 of users and 60 brands. So, first application is Ring Central, which is a cloud-based services, and second application is uh, uh, the ERP, which is uh, hosted on uh, a legacy data center first, and and it seems that we will move uh, it for on AWS uh, soon. Uh, so we will deploy uh, both applications today in, uh, I think in five minutes, uh, it will be uh, finished. So let's start with the first. So the first request is about RingCentral. 
So what, what AL asked me is to, uh, to deploy a new apps um, and uh, in order to keep uh, the traffic optimized and secure into the backbone, not going to a traditional internet, but to keep the, 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 the a way to manage the performance from end to end, we will aggress the traffic for uh, EMEA user to Amsterdam and Zurich and for US uh, to New York and Miami. So we will uh, um, start with Link Central. We will uh, manage the, the security uh, part and also the, the, the optimization part. So let's start. Um, let's go to, to, to networking. Um, and what you asked is to use the P5 and to um, uh, create a new rule for um, the, the, the EMEA ring central. So it's really easy. I just have to, to create a new uh, internet rule. Let's call it EMEA ring central. On the what, I will choose the application. So the application is Ring Central. Okay. Uh, the from, um, let's check again. So if it's for the EMEA factory, which are physical site, and also EMEA cells uh, who can be on site and also work from home. So let's start to choose uh, the physical site. So factory EMEA and also the cells EMEA the group of people coming from the AD, Active Directory. So you ask me to put P5, okay. We will use uh, Kato uh, automatic in order to use the base way depending on the latency, the jitter, the packet loss. And in order to, to, to keep the traffic optimized and secure, we will um, uh, use the egress uh, routing and uh, we will put Amsterdam and uh, Zurich as well. Let's put the second world also for uh, the US at this time, US uh, ring central. So it's the same rules. Uh, I choose ring central, the sales, no, not the sales EMEA, sorry. It's US, so sales US. Okay, um, factory US. Okay, oh, I have one, this one drop. Prudvia, you ask, I think, Miami and New York. Yeah, that's, that's fine. So let's choose Miami, New York. Okay, and that's it uh, for the optimization part. I just have to click on save and it's fully deployed. Uh, we will recap just after what we are doing, but you will see that the, the, the hardware, the appliance are completely uh, transparent, uh, invisible. So we just manage object, we click on save and that's it. You have nothing to do, no staging, no synchronization, everything is automatic. So yes, we just uh, put uh, two uh, network rules uh, with P5 uh, priority for both uh, and egress routing to Miami and New York for US and Amsterdam and Zurich for, for EMEA. Now we will open uh, the connectivity to Ring Central. So it's really easy. You go to the internet firewall. So we will now open the Ring Central uh, access uh, in two clicks. So we just have to put the new rules. Uh, so the wall is here. So let's call it Ring Central access. We want to enable a uh, few people and few sites. So the first will be the sales, which is the group coming from the Active, active Directory again. Uh, we will add also uh, our factory. Group factory all, which combine US and also EMEA. Now we just have to choose an application, Ring Central. and to allow the communication events track in order to track any event, click on saved and that's it. The application is now open and the, the rule is fully distributed to, uh, to the all uh, Kato pop in the world. So really easy. Now let's move to the second um, application, which is a more traditional application. It's an ERP hosted in a legacy data center. So again, we have this time to, to, uh, to create a new priority, P12, and to add factory US and EMEA plus the, plus the cell. So again, it will be very, uh, very easy. 
go back to networking. This time we have to, to create a new class of traffic in order to prioritize with the P12 priority. So really easy. I just have to put P12. I, I can choose the behavior in order to have no limit, always limit, or limit only when there, there are some congestion. So let's, let's put it. Um, the P12 is no is not ready. Uh, it's empty because I, I have to, to create the network calls for uh, DRP. So again, really easy. Uh, go back to network calls. We will just have to add a new one rules above. So it's here. ERP. So what is it? Uh, it's a custom apps, uh, including the CRM and the ERP. Uh, the from is the sales and the factory. So let's put the sales in the rules, the factory. Uh, the destination is um, the DC, uh, but it seems that the, the CTO plan to move also to IWS. So we can choose IWS cloud in order to, uh, to move without any disruption in the, in the future. Uh, we want to put P12 um, priority for the routing. We will keep the same. Let Kato choose the right uh, path. And uh, we will uh, keep the active TCP acceleration in order to accelerate the TCP traffic. And with that, we are okay. Just have to click on save. Again, um, no any, any modification on the hardware. Everything is transparent. Just uh, five clicks and everything is okay. Now, again, we have to open uh, the communication to this ERP. So as the, the, the application is hosted in legacy uh, data center or cloud DC, but it's a, a branch or cloud DC, which is uh, uh, in the entire of the IT, uh, IT company. So we have to go to the one firewall this time and we have to create a, a rule. So add rules above. Let's call it ERP access this time. Let's choose the user. So the sales, oh, sorry. Um, plus the factory. In destination, we will um, want to open to DC, DC all, and also to the site which is IWS for the future. Um, and then, then we just have to choose the, the CRM and the ERP, add and close. We will allow these rules event to track, click on save. And again, that's it. We deploy two uh, new apps, Ring Central uh, for US and uh, EMEA with a lot of optimization in order to, to optimize from end to end from the, the branch to the UK services. And uh, then we deploy the, the ERP. Uh, we deploy network calls to optimize and then the security rules. And uh, as you can see, we, we deployed uh, two, two new apps for 3,000 of users and 60 sites in five minutes. So the, the, the hardware is transparent, invisible, and you don't have to lose time to synchronize because all words are, are distributed automatically to the Kaito Cloud. So number of sites will uh, never impact the time to deploy. So you will deploy new workload at the same speed of, uh, if, if you have five sites to 500 or 5,000, the amount of work is the same because you have nothing to do after. Everything is simple, it's Kaito. Great, Sylvain, this is great. Thank you very, very much.